I am Jake. Alex. And hope everybody's gonna have a happy Thanksgiving. Yay! For My favorite holiday of the year. For today, we're gonna be reacting for the first time in a while to a South Park episode. A show that I've come to really love in recent years and one you uh, were a fan of back in the day. Yep, the original seasons, yep. And this episode is from 2011. I can't remember exactly which season, but it's been uh, 12 years, I think, this episode came out. This is a History Channel Thanksgiving. All right, fantastic. Where they really uh, take the piss out of the History Channel and their setup. And uh, I won't give too much away, but this is a pretty crazy episode. Pretty timely for the holiday. Without further ado, let's jump in. <laughs> the human scent I've had. Let's all take our seats. Garrison. We all know Thanksgiving is only two weeks away, so the school has arranged for a lecture from a real live Native American. Hello, boys and girls. My name is <laughs> David, and I'm 116th Cherokee Indian. Oh. Does that mean we only have to pay 116th attention to you? <laughs> Was Thanksgiving about turkey and peace? Or was it the beginning of the genocide of an entire race? Oh. Thanksgiving is about murder? <laughs> this is bullcrap. The sign with a report on Thanksgiving? Well, it is kind of true, you know. The Native Americans got pretty screwed over. Yeah, now that video game time is getting screwed over by them. <laughs> <laughs> if we have to write a report on Thanksgiving, let's just go downstairs and watch TV. How is that going to help? The History Channel is probably playing Thanksgiving specials back to back. You're watching oh, the okay. History Channel, where the truth is history. <laughs> a lot has been written about what really happened at that first historic dinner. Who needs to read a bunch of stupid books when we've got History Channel? We know the first Thanksgiving was in the TV fall is the way. But new evidence suggests that the first exchanging of food may have been visited by aliens. Yes. <laughs> Every journal entry you research, not one entry mentions anything about aliens not being there. <laughs> and what yes. about the food? Does the appearance of stuffing at the first Thanksgiving table suggest a kind of alien technology? There is no reference to stuffing before 1621. Where did it come from? Did it Watch come from space? <laughs> is it mere coincidence that Cape Cod, when viewed from space, looks like an alien life form? <laughs> what exactly did the pilgrims experience? How exactly did those beings shape the dinner we celebrate every November? No. What? Cod, why are you being so grumpy? Are you in your period again? <laughs> Uh, 
Symbology. Yes. Get all those tourists out of here. All right, people, let's clear out. We need you all to disperse. <laughs> huh? Guys, you give him five fingers. Somehow knew about all of this. You must know 
how to get Natalie Portman to open her wormhole. I don't know where this is going. You have any brothers or sisters, Natalie? I had a lot of really close friends growing up, but not any brothers or sisters. I was an only child. I have dual citizenship, United States and Israel. I went to Harvard while I was acting. I got a BA. But I did classes at University of Jerusalem, too. Cool. Cool. You want to order some dessert? Thanks, that was a lot of fun. Yeah, it was cool. So, is there any way you... What? You know, could you... What? Would you please just open your wormhole? Mm. No. <laughs> turned into a big uh, dumping ground on the History Channel. Absolutely. I mean, that, definitely a direction the History Channel has gone for many decades now. Yeah, you check out some of the stuff they put out. It's not really history. Don't tell my wife. She loves Oak Island. So. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, there's a lot of creative stuff here. Some good allusions to certain sci-fi movies. And uh, the part with the guy who's like, I am one sixteenth Cherokee. <laughs> well, there was some, <laughs> there was some commenter a while back. Can't remember exactly what he said, but he was like, "Must be friends with Elizabeth Warren." <laughs> it was definitely culturally insensitive, but that's pretty much South Park's branding, right? So yeah, they poke fun at the um, absurdity of uh, not getting it. Yeah. But I do think we can all we can all come together this Thanksgiving and agree with our not hatred of the History Channel, but just <laughs> like understanding of what the History Channel really is, what it's yeah. become. And history is history, and uh, we can all enjoy stuffing this year. Yep. Break out the anti-Indian Godzilla oh, God. robot. <laughs> Best, the best part was the ships, the floating ships. There. Yeah. yeah, that was a nice little touch. Yeah. Some impressive animation bits, and uh, hope you all have a happy holiday as we enter into the um, Christmas season. Ooh, 